Hi, this is Josie G, and I am with Bushido today. He is walking behind over here. Here he is. You can kind of see him. <laughs> he's my grand puppy. Anyway, I wanted to show you the great things I got from... Oh, he's trying to take my new witch. He's trying to take this little lamb. Um, isn't this adorable? This is from uh, Target. He, he's been trying to get this ever since I pulled it out. Here he is. He wants it so bad. Um, he thinks it's his toy. I'm going to have to... No, 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 Bushy. I'm going to have to put this <laughs> in my... Sorry about that. In a way. Let's put it that way. I'm going to have to put it away. Okay. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. We're outside here, and I want to show you the great things I found at Target and at Joann's. First of all, let's start with Target. I found these two great little um, jackets. Take a look in your clearance aisle. These were only $2.40 each, and I got them for my um, my twin girls, um, Polly and, <laughs> and Birdie. And... Um, and then Bushido keeps trying to want to he keeps trying to want to get into any everything. All right, then I got this cute our generation retro outfit. Um, it's not exactly the one I wanted. I was looking for something else for uh, St. Patty's Day, but it's purple. It's really cute, and it is a really cute retro outfit. It was only thirteen twenty nine, I think, or something like that. Um, it was on. It was three dollars and something less than what it normally was. So it's a great. Uh, price point for those of you who are trying to get some of these great retro outfits that are on sale probably still um, today. And then I found these uh, eraser foods and it has like an eggplant and a uh, head of cabbage or lettuce, a big tomato and so forth in it. So take a look at that. That was in the dollar um, aisle. These little sunglasses were in the dollar aisle. Of course these won't fit your 18 inch dolls but they might fit your, they will fit your bigger dolls. And I thought they'd be really cute on my 36 inch or 38 inch Barbies. They'd look really swanky. And then I found these um, ribbons and these two. This is a crocheted lace. I thought that was really pretty. I love the vintage stuff. And then this baker's twine, which would be really great in like if you're using it to wrap packages in your um, patisserie or your other, your bistros or whatever else you need to wrap those little boxes or bags or what have you that you've got for your uh, your doll stores, okay? And then, oops, I feel these are a little sloppy, and somebody's nose is in the way, sorry, <laughs> somebody keeps wanting to take my items, ah, sorry about that. This is going to be one of those joke videos, I can tell, I might have to redo this one. Um, then I found this... <laughs> <laughs> this little item here, which is really fun, it's a tic-tac-toe um, board, and they came in all different kinds. I just picked the chickens and the eggs because you can probably hear in the background, those are my turkeys. Uh, I have two turkeys, Saturday and Charming, and then I have one chicken, Chickers. Um, <laughs> you can see Bushido's trying to trying his best to to stay involved in in this video. Um, so I got this one, and I, it's perfect doll size. So I thought it'd be great on the table for them. And then I found two great books. These are doll size as well. They're Dr. Seuss, Horton Hears a Who, and uh, Funny Things Are Everywhere. Um, and then I found these great little um, erasers, which would be cute for food. Or I make earrings, as you know, out of erasers. And I like to get the seasonal ones. Here's the chickens, and here's the, um, there's the carrots, chickens, and there's the bunnies. Perfect. They're really cute. Doll size as well. And then these two notes, and this one was really cute, I thought, because it looks like a pad that you would write your orders on for your um, diner, your patisserie, what have you. And then this one is just, just a little, they're sticky, sticky notes. Um, this one's just for fun. Um, also found these two little sets of socks. There's two socks each, and one has a dog and one has a cat. They were $1.40 on clearance in the baby aisle, and they would be perfect for your bigger dolls. Um, and then I love these. These little flowers are actually uh, dyed um, burlap really beautiful, very vintage, and they would look great. And they're, they're attached to a uh, small little, if you can see that, uh, small little clothespins, but they could be still stuck in a doll's hair or they could be attached to something else. 
I thought they were really cute. And of course, you got to have flips or something to <laughs> keep you going while you're shopping. Um, pirates. These little pirates were a dollar, and they were. They came with the barrels and um, all kinds of little fun things in here. And so your boys, if you have boy dolls, they could play um, the, you know, the red pirates versus the black pirates. So pretty cool stuff there. All right, moving on here. Um, I also went to Joann's and I got some stuff for uh, Mickey for St. Patty's Day. Um, got these great little pom-poms. I love the shiny pom-poms. And then I also got these pom-poms, which have holes in the middle of them. They're beatable, which I'm going to give those a try. I don't know if anybody else has tried them. I uh, found these little green shoes, which I'd ordered a pair of these types of green shoes online. These were $6, $5.99. If you have a coupon, it's well worth it because you make it a 40% off. Um, a lot of the stores, the craft stores, will honor each other's coupons. Um, then I got these. Uh, these are glitter glue pens. Uh, if you do a project and then stick this, just little dots of it on the top of your projects, it makes it just shiny and, and fun. There's my receipt, sorry. And then he, these came in sets of two because they're for little kid's hair, but as you can see, they're very ornate and you could probably cut them and use them as a trim or use them in your doll's hair or, I mean, you could use them as a trim for like a dress, um, put them on their arms um, as something fun, like an armband, use them in their hair. There's all kinds of uses for these great things. Um, use them as decoration in your for the day, uh, that sort of thing. Okay, then I got white uh, foam, fun foam, which I see Bushido's already got his paw print on. Um, <laughs> Brown fun foam for the backs of cookies. White is for the icing. And then um, I found this is a really beautiful piece of vellum. And look, it looks really great over this uh, colored uh, or uh, written on piece of vellum. And then I found this, or not vellum, uh, cardstock. Then I found this, which the wording is really fun. It's got things like uh, salt and pepper, creme brulee, croissant. Bon Appetit, things like that in there. So, so I thought that was flambe, baking, sugar and spice. So I thought that was really fun. It might go really wonderful inside something that I create. Okay, um, got the, the um, um, pipe cleaners. And then I found this small little, these were a dollar, These were this was a dollar. It's a little chalkboard plaque that you can stand up. See, this is what it looks like. Oops, sorry. This is what it looks like when it's standing. A little small one. I thought that was clever. Um, and I got these. These were 50 or 70% off. They were $2.99. And I think it lived, if they were 50, they were $1.50. Um, for all of this stuff with two yards of fabric, I paid only $18. Um, with a with a like a 20% off coupon too, um, the the uh, lady was very sweet. Um, anyway, I thought these were very vintage looking. Even if they weren't for St. Patty's Day, they would look really cute hanging up in in the doll's um, room or something like that, or a kitchen or something. And this one says, "May God bless you." I love this one. It's very. I love the lady on it. Very cute. And then I found I found an outfit that I really wanted, but I didn't want to pay $10 for it because they have the Springfield line at Joann's. This is where I got these at. Um, and this looks like one of my cat's Ivy, Secret Ivy, into trouble. So, um, and it's got sparkles on it. I don't know if you can see that, but it does have sparkles. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make an outfit out of these socks for Bailey because um, for some reason I don't have enough um, outfits. And again, like as you know, although I did get fabric, green fabric, and then some leftover red fabric. And believe it or not, jo at Joann's, um, the uh, uh, Valentine's Day fabric was still only 40% or 50% off. I couldn't believe it, Bushido. Um, so uh, that that was a bummer. I was really surprised about that. But this is really cute. These little socks and. 
Um, so I'm going to make her a little outfit because I just made some outfits for my small dolls with socks. So this is what I got today and at these two stores had a great time shopping, finding some things for you to take a look at and uh, you know so you can go and grab your finds real quick too uh, and see what you can come up with for the holidays that are coming up here very quickly. All right, thanks so much and take care and have a good afternoon and thank you for indulging my little grand puppy, Bushy. All right, take care. Bye-bye.